Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my castle. The king is here back with another video. So it's been like a couple of days. I think it's been what, four days, five days since I made my last video. But I gotta do a lot of reaction, man. I gotta catch up, man. Uh, I've been really busy. And what sucks is like, I don't know my schedule for my roommate. So like he can come anytime. Uh, he's at football practice right now. So I don't know how long he has his practice for. But yeah, man, I just been really busy with uh, school and shit like that, and like not having like the time to make videos. But I have a lot of videos to have to react to today. So last time was this time. Let's get to our first reaction, man. Roman Reign expose John Cena, and let's get it, man. Let's see what I he has said to say. Before and I'll say it again. I would boo this too. John Cena might be the best talker ever. The guy can run his mm. mouth and he can spin it, but the thing is. Sometimes he says stupid Like like trying to say that I'm the next John Cena. I mean come on man. Do I walk talk or even look like Cena? I mean do I don't know I don't have a mirror but do I look like a jacked up white guy with a giant head and a military crew cut? Nah, if I did I wouldn't have a career here you don't believe me? Ask, uh, ask Alex Riley about that. Ooh! Oh! <laughs> you see, I'm not like John. I don't have to talk. I let my actions talk for me. That is why when I say something, it means something. Like when I said John Cena is a fake ass little bitch. Oh, okay. It's because he is. But not only that, John Cena is the biggest hypocrite to ever step foot in a WWE ring. And if you don't believe me there, John will tell you himself. The guy who's not here this week, the first time he got a taste of the bright lights of Hollywood and then kick it back to Hollywood. I always showed up and I never left. I'll see you next week, movie star. That's true. That. Should we bring Cena out here, San Jose? Y'all gotta get a little louder. Should we bring Cena out here, San Jose? I'm afraid that's not gonna be loud enough because John's not here. So everything he said was just a lie. It was just talk. <laughs> and that's why the result at No Mercy is going to be the same as it was at that WrestleMania. Only this time, he's going to be beat by a different Samoan. So San Jose, I'll see y'all next time for sure. And John, I'll see you Sunday. Movie star. Woo! Well, they pulled no punches in the weeks leading up to this rivalry on Sunday, but guys, I can tell you one thing. John Roman, Cena, Roman, Roman, Roman. He, he's getting better. I can, I can say for sure. He is getting way, way, way better, which is good. Which is good for WWE because he needs to improve because this is what is going on with this uh, feud now is John Cena basically passing the torch to Roman Reigns, you know what I mean? Uh, so which is a good thing and I felt like this feud and I hope this feud continues because I want to see uh, Cena improve more with this, uh, not Cena, I mean Roman Reigns improve more with his mic skill because think about it this way bro, his mic skill improved so much since, since, since he's been feuding with John Cena because he has to. He has to, man. He has to work on his mic skill. And that is the only thing that's hurting him. Even when he took a couple of pauses, I feel like he was still like trying to think what he should say or like trying to memorize his line. But but I think he's improving, man. I believe 100% that he's improving. And he still, I think he still needs to continue his feud with John Cena. I hope this feud doesn't end just because it's going to help 
Roman Reigns with his My Skill man. Uh, but anyways, uh, let me know what you guys think about this promo, man. I wouldn't say expose John Cena, but this was a really good promo by Roman Reigns. That I can give that to you. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. If you did, uh, please subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and share. Uh, let's get to that 900 subscribers. We're almost there. Uh, yeah, and the king will see you next time. Peace.